Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Aquarian Sun, Moon and Rising Sign for the last week of August. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is um, the last week of August, but a beautiful reading, whatever the situation is. Um, I'm seeing um, the Three of Swords in the reverse with um, a partner. Okay, this week begins from the 27th until the 2nd of uh, April. Of September I'm sorry um it is a fire week it is a positive fire week there's a lot of passion I'm seeing a lot of passion coming up um in this week there is a lot of passion that is coming up new starts I'm seeing information ju judgment is coming up so breakthroughs about the king of pentacles so we're we are going to be looking at that now Monday you start the week with the ace of pentacles which is good so um, some of you could be getting paid some of you financial money could be coming to you this is good because it's in the upright position it's an um, earth energy so this is going to be a very very positive day um, on Tuesday you have the two of cups this is wonderful because it could be um, that um, you and your partner are going to be um, receiving some extra financial help so this is going to be good on um, Wednesday you have the king of Pentacles whoever this king is whether this person is is over the age of 40 it is an earth sign it could be that this is your father or this is your partner for some of you it could be this is your husband and um, financial um, support extra money is coming in for you guys and you're going to be receiving a message on Thursday now Thursday the energy of breakthrough the air energy is here it is a water energy so information is going to be coming through this information is going to give you a, a new start Friday is a wonderful day go out if you're looking for a relationship this is going to be happening some of you could be meeting someone who has money and um, this person uh, could be one to connect with you because obviously this person had had an eye on you for a long time this is someone new who's about to come in your life and this is someone who is um, extremely extremely positive okay this is someone who is positive this is a love of a lifetime who you're about to meet it's not a twin flame and it's it, it can be a soulmate but it's not a twin flame on Saturday whatever the loss is not to worry there is a loss some of you could be ending a relationship it could be your father moving on some of you could be um, walking away from a relationship that has to do with someone who is a, a, a Capricorn a Sun Moon and Rising Capricorn and um, some of you could be receiving message on Sunday um, from this um, Capricorn of a new start okay some of you could be receiving some messages on Sunday from this Capricorn about a new start okay so let's see um, what is happening so some of you in this week could be meeting someone who has money um, there is love and also financial abundance that is coming in um, some of you um, um, look out because there is someone that you're about to meet this person could be financially stable and this person could be wanting to take this um, to a new level and it is someone who is uh, um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, and it, um, this is a wonderful energy it could be um, this is obviously someone who is already born so some of you could be connecting with someone who is uh, um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and this is someone who um, come back in this lifetime um, to be in a relationship with you this person could be financially stable or you could be financial stable but it is a relationship that is going to last for some time okay we have the two of cups and the, and the heart the a loss but you're um, making up back to this and um, you have the energy of uh, the five of cups in reverse with the heart in reverse so this is good so some of you um 
it could be a, a, a situation with that you have with your husband um, you know maybe um, just um, a conflict or that sort of a thing that you have with your husband it could be with your father or brother whosoever this person is or it could be a mentor or that sort of a thing and you felt a loss but now you are re regaining balance and you're thinking because obviously it was someone you were in a relationship with and this person have moved on and you are okay with that you're just going forward in your life let's see what is the message that is coming from this um, king of Pentacles um, the eight of swords you're seeing the truth about this person so whatever that was happening or whatever that was transpiring is as if um, information come to you about this person whoever this king is information comes to you about this person this person was um, very very much um, um, deceptive okay um, this person um, wasn't really speaking the truth um, it's it's a sad situation but you realize that this person was a little bit um, of a, a, decept, a deceitful person because a deceitful and jealousy and information is going to be coming to you whatever this information is this information is going to be telling you something about a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man and this man is over the age of 40 and whatever the message is is something that you're going to find out that this man has done and this person was not being honest at all okay this person wasn't being honest at all it is someone who is very deceptive someone who will sell you out for um, just money he's all about money and um, it's as if some of you realize that and you kind of um, remove this person out of your life because you have seen that this person is not really someone who is very positive and someone who is working on a negative energy vibration because um, you're now seeing the truth because the information is as if um, whether via your intuition or, or whether via your intuition this truth is coming out or via an, an, another way this truth is coming out about this person and it's not really nice your outcomes for the week is that you have a strong foundation whether it is in love or whether it's in your financial situation you have a strong foundation there is someone who is going to come in a younger person because obviously you guys are working with the, the hurt energy the people of the earth energy whoever this person is that is coming out is going to be um, someone who is uh, um, someone this young person is going to be helping you this could be um, your your son or your daughter coming in to connect with you and helping you out financial for um, the older people okay and, and and they're going to give you some um, stabil and foundation in your life there's a new start if you're looking for a house if you're looking for a new house a new apartment if um, you are about to um, if you're about to um, trans um, transpire which you're about to move in with someone it is going to be a very good start and a very good relationship you have the energy of the Sun that is coming here so your outcomes is um, basically a very 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 let me see yeah a very positive um a very positive positive situation that is about to happen it's a very very positive um week for you um aquarians because you end up with the energy of the sun whatever um house um some of you i can see that some of you are going to decide to um, move in with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person this relationship is going to last for a, li a lifetime you could be deciding to get married to this person and this relationship is going to be um, lasting for a very long time because this person really cares deeply for you and it could be for some of you that it is your child whoever this king of Pentacles is you have a strong foundation against this person um, you're going to decide it could be that you're married to this person 
and you have realized that this person have been lying and deceiving because this is lying and deceiving jealousy lies and deceiving the truth is going to come out this could be someone who you know but you have a strong foundation the truth is going to be coming out about this person about the lies and deception that he has been going on with so i am basically loving your week because it's going to be a fabulous week because um, I love when the energy of deception comes out because when people are lying and that is the month of September because you're leaving the month of um, um, August going in September and you're seeing the lying deceitfulness of people coming out um, your energy that I got for you guys because I'm using the crystal deck um, this is the rainbow crystal and it is um, um, multifacets and it says there are many layers and dimension to the situation or person you are asking about so it could be this um, man that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn over the age of um, 40 and um, they are saying that there's many um, multi facets of this person that you're not seeing. So obviously, um, you maybe see saw this person in a true light, and now you're seeing the truth of this person. That this person is not really vibrating in a positive energy. That that this person is really um, very much um, deceitful. This is a deceitful person and you're basically seeing the truth of a situation about this person that this person has been very deceptive okay i'm trying for you guys to really really see this so um you're going to really see that this person is, is very deceptive some of you could have feel felt this intuition um intuition um, your intuition that this person wasn't um, being honest and it is now coming out ladies and gentlemen I want to wish you a wonderful week please remember to listen to the the month of September reading and listen to your Sun Moon arising please like share thumbs up these reading and um, leave a message about this situation information is going to be coming out about this king of um, um, pentacles whoever this person is is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn and uh, it could be your boss for some of you because some of you um, here is the two of cups this could be your boss but whatever the situation is you have a strong foundation if he's lying and if he is um, you know uh, deceptive it's gonna all come out okay so um, I want to say to you guys thank you for being here thank you for being back namaste until next week Oh, 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 oh,